today's video is regarding HP Office Jet Pro 9015 printer. I'm going to show you how to do the quick unboxing and setup of this printer. So let's start with the unboxing. Once your printer is on, we have to go to the display panel and we have to start the setup process. For that, first we need to select the language. So you can select the language according to your country. And just confirm the language here. Select the country where you want to register this printer. And once you select it, just confirm. And the next step is to install the ink cartridges. I'm going to show you how to install the setup ink cartridges in this printer. So these are the setup ink cartridges we have to install in this printer. So just take them out. Just take them out of the box. So these are the two pairs of setup ink cartridges. So just remove them from both sides. Here are the setup ink cartridges. And the ink cartridge chamber door is at the front of this printer. So open this door by pulling it outside and wait for the chamber to move and come here. All the markings are here and now we have to install the ink cartridges one by one. Now to install the ink cartridges it's very simple. As you can see this side and uh, there. Now to installing the ink cartridge is very simple. You just have to install this side to the inside of the printer so black will go to the black side so you simply have to slide it in so once you push it in it will just lock there so you have to push it in unless you see it is locked and the yellow will go there so this is you will see the yellow seal and this side will go inside you have to see that the HP logo should stay upside and the seal round seal will stay downside and you have to just slide it in once you push it it will lock there now this is the pink color so do it same the seal should be facing downwards and the logo should be upside just install it and this is the last which is blue in color so the seal facing down and the HP logo upside now all the four ink cartridges are installed now we have to close the ink cartridge chamber door so once the ink cartridge door is closed you will see it's checking the printer so just wait for the processing once we close the ink cartridge chamber door you will see this screen it says instant ink ready and it says thanks for using these cartridges now we have to click ok to continue the process the next step is to load the a4 size sheet at the paper tray so you have to push the paper tray out as you can see here and adjust the size here 
place the A4 size sheets and now we have to just close this. On the display screen we can see it says align the print head and to get the best possible print quality from the printer alignment is required so we just have to press the continue button so printer is going to print the alignment page now Open the top scanner bed and place the place the alignment sheet facing left hand side upwards. Close the door and click on the scan button. On the display panel we can see the printer has been aligned successfully so click OK button. On the next screen we see it says to complete the setup we have to go to the HP website at 123.hp.com but you can select the question mark here and the next option is network setup click on that and we get three options here to do the Ethernet setup wireless setup or we can connect it later so just select anything you want for example connect later now click OK and click OK again. Now it says thanks for choosing the HP. So here is the main display screen. That means we have successfully set up our printer. Now we are ready for the copy. So here we can see the main screen of the printer. So we have all the options available like copy, scan, print, fax and also it has some apps here now so here we can see we have completed the initial setup of this printer and now to do the copy we can simply uh, open the top scanner page and place a page here facing downwards like this and we can close the lid now go to the display panel Here we can see the copy option click on that it is a document and now give the copy command so it's very easy to use this printer after the setup so instantly we can start the copy function so here we can see it has done the copy and the quality of the print is good The next thing I can show you is how to do the Wi-Fi setup. For that we have to go to the setting which is on the top here. So click on the setting icon and click again. This is the setting icon. Here we get the network setup option as you can see here. So click on that and we are going to use the wireless setting. So click on wireless setting. Now click on the wireless setup wizard. It will search for the available wireless routers in your home or office. Select the Wi-Fi network you want to connect this printer. Now use this keypad to enter the password. Once you enter the password click OK and it will connect with the Wi-Fi network so it's connecting now overall I can say the printer is really easy to set up and we can connect it with the home or office Wi-Fi network without any problem so it takes only few minutes for the connection and now we can add it into the different devices so that we can use it for wireless printing and scanning also this printer is capable of doing multiple scannings as you can see there is a tray on the top so this is the feeder tray thanks for watching